So I've got a 150 gallon stock tank right here and somebody just sent me a stock tank cover at no charge for this review and it comes in its own little pouch here. I don't think you'll ever get it back in the pouch after you open it. But this is just simply to uh, to cover your, your stock tank, regardless of what you have in it, whether you're gonna have some straw in there or, uh, or you're gonna have some plants in here or water in here. Now, uh, this is gonna be something that's going to, uh, to keep your product in here dry. It's also going to provide some heat for it. So uh, this might be really good for water. We'll just see how easy it is to install. It does have a couple of cinches on the sides so that we can pull it nice and tight and keep it on there kind of like a swimming pool cover. So there you go, it's a really nice cover, easy to install. Uh, it's gonna keep your, uh, it's gonna keep whatever product you have inside of here, like I said, whether it's gonna be hay or straw, water, maybe even some compost in here. It's gonna keep it protected from the elements. We're gonna turn some water on and see if this is waterproof. So as you can see, if we had a really good downpour, it's gonna collect the water right there in the middle. Uh, it's not seeping through the cover. Uh, one thing that we could do is try to tighten that just a little bit more. So I was able to cinch it up just a little bit more, but still, uh, unless you're sitting on a hill, you're not gonna be able to uh, prevent that from accumulating water on top. Okay, so there is your protective cover for the 150 gallon stock tank. Uh, it will accumulate water in the center. It does not leak through, so it is a waterproof cover. Uh, however, if you get a torrential downpour, you might want to consider maybe setting it on the side of the hill so stuff runs off, or, uh, or you might just want to flip this upside down. You've seen how it works. Now you can make your decision on whether you need one or not.